Hey guys, Commodore Pet here, and it has been a very long time since I've actually made a video on this channel. And I'm going to explain my absence and what I'm going to be doing moving forwards. So, pretty much, I haven't uploaded since like August of last year, which is a pretty long time. And that was mainly because I just saw the decline of Jartix, really. Jartix Skywars as a whole. You know, I've been playing Jartix Skywars for a very long time, and, you know, as much as I enjoy playing Jartix Skywars, I notice the decline. You know, it's just getting very low player counts, and there's really no growth there, and I was getting a little bit bored because playing it for years and grinding leaderboards, eventually you do get very burned out, even though you actually love the server and the game mode that you're playing. So I decided to basically take a break. I started another channel, which is like survival, hardcore Minecraft sort of stuff, and that channel has been doing pretty well over the last couple of months uh that channel i got it monetized and it has like over 1400 subscribers now and i've actually made like a decent amount of money I, I say decent amount of money it's more like 80 bucks off that channel but like i mean you know it's been doing decently well but i still love minecraft pvp because minecraft pvp is my home it's what i've been doing for years and years it's what's kept me playing the game and i always wanted to come back and do something but Every single time I come back to 1.8, I just see it die more and more and more. It's just on this decline that unfortunately will never go away. I think the final nail is being hammered into the coffin of legacy Minecraft combat. And as someone who doesn't enjoy 1.20 combat, I feel like I'm stuck in the situation where either I play a dying version of Minecraft or I move on to something else. And what I'm going to be moving on to is bedrock edition now you're probably wondering why bedrock edition the reason is because bedrock edition is very similar to java edition in terms of like 1.8 combat it you know you, you click you know you, you get like high cps your butterfly clicking whatever like everything all of that still applies to that version although like w tapping and stuff is very different it still is very similar to 1.8 and a lot of my skills transfer over and i think it'll be really fun because i've played bedrock edition on and off since the pandemic like i was basically playing jartic sky wars and like hive sky wars at the same time i was playing bedrock and java and you know at first i was like oh bedrock edition sucks i'm not going to play it but after playing it i realized that it's actually not bad it is actually very fun and you can get it for free. I know a lot of you guys are non-premium or cracked Minecraft players and you can't afford Minecraft, but there's ways to get Bedrock Edition for free and you can make as many alternate accounts as you want on Bedrock because all you need is a Microsoft account, which is like free to create. You just need an email. So I highly recommend checking that out. There is also clients you can download, like Onyx Client is the one I recommend to get like toggle sprint and reach display and all the things you would have on like Lunar Client, for example. And overall, it is very fun. And Bedrock Edition is very much kind of like 1.8 Combat or the 1.8 Community just like years ago. Like game modes like Sky Wars is still very popular. Thousands of players. SG gets hundreds of players on these big Minecraft servers. When was the last time you saw survival games on a Minecraft server get 300 plus players? Like, pretty much never. And I feel like that's really the way to go in terms of PvP content that's still 1.8 style, but it also allows me to like grow on YouTube because I feel like there's a lot of growth to be had on Bedrock Edition. Now, I'm not saying I won't play Java Edition. Like, you'll still see me on Jartic Skywars every now and then, but I don't think I'll be recording it anymore because I feel like I just need to move on at this point. It was kind of the same very many years ago when I played a server called Latin Gamers. It was in a similar situation. It was practice PvP server. It had hundreds of players. It was very popular and then it died and then I had to move on and I moved on to Jartix and now it's just in that same cycle again. And I know some of you probably won't stick around. Some of you will, but I would just say give it a chance because more videos will be uploaded from me. And I think that Overall, you guys would probably enjoy it, and it'll be very fun. So anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I know I haven't uploaded in a very long time, but please be sure to like and subscribe for the future content and what I'm going to be moving towards, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye, and have a great day.